Hey, Hot Ones fans and Six Pack Philosophers out there, uh, we're doing something a little bit different than our normal show today. For anyone who didn't know, me and Anna are actually huge fans of the show Hot Ones, mm -hmm. which is... First We Feast. By First We Feast. It's returning for its... I think fourth it's fourth. Fourth season. Fourth, yes. Fourth season this Thursday. So we wanted to do a tribute. Mm -hmm. Um... I've ordered for myself uh, some of the Last Dab Hot Ones hot sauce, and so we're going to do a complete unboxing, mm -hmm. uh, taste test, and yeah. wing gauntlet Yeah, uh, here on camera, live, so strap in, this is going to be a ride. All right, I guess first thing is to open up the package. We have our package here delivered from uh, Brooklyn, New York. So let's dig in. My, my shamefully dull knife. For any of the Six Pack Philosophy fans, you'll know that we recently did a show on torture. And um, while to be considered torture, it does have to be uh, without the person's consent. But I'll say at the very least, while I have consented, I am very nervous so all this right. this may be tortuous yes uh, all right we have the hedonist uh little logo on the front i like and... that little philosophy throwback there oh yeah yeah play off a of hedonist oh this is cool oh, how pretty all right it comes with a, a little uh note uh signed i don't know if you can see this on camera signed by sean evans here at the bottom uh, we want to read it? it uh, it's not too terribly long. Yeah, sure, read it. All right, what is going on, Hot Ones fans? This is Sean Evans coming at you from a desk where I am sitting down to write a big thank you for buying The Last Dab, a hot sauce that is very near and dear to my heart. When it came time to create our wing tin sauce for Hot Ones, we wanted to make sure that, it's, that it not only delivered a haymaker of heat... This is what we're about to have, a haymaker, haymaker. of heat okay. uh, to our celebrity guests, but also tasted good. Something that is rarely taken into account. The higher the Scoville climb, something that is rarely taken into account, the higher the Scoville climb. I'm biased, but I'd say our chili gurus, heatness and smoking Ed's curry of pucker butt peppered, pepper. Uh, company knocked it out of the park. Here's what I ask. When you break it open, film yourself. And well, you can't put the note in the box, but luckily we're doing it. <laughs> film yourself and your friends tasting the sauce and hit us on social media using the hashtag, hashtag the last dab. I love seeing fans dabbing just as much as I like seeing Kevin Durant or Steve-O take down the last wing of death. Well, Sean Evans, you're about to get more than just a taste on this one. I just got a little bit of a chill, yeah. actually. All right, so I, I want to point out on these bottles, uh, this is something Sean Evans pointed out. It's got a red tint to it, uh, as opposed to the Season 3 green tint. And the reason he said was that the um, harvest of Pepper X was even hotter, and it gave it a red color. So we are this getting one? Yes. Oh, fuck. So we are getting Season 4 super hot last dab. Uh, that's just kind of the uh, the beauty of working. Beauty is uh, not the word I would use. <laughs> beauty is the word I'm going to use. The beauty of working with small batch hot sauces. It, it, it changes from year to year, and and we see that. I can say as a hot sauce fan myself, I have here 357 and bomb. Um, I, this is things I, I eat regularly All the on time. my own. Lots. Uh, so this isn't just something I'm doing because because of the show. Um, I, I am a, a, a true. Uh, enthusiast Scoville enthusiast um, yeah. so uh, I've tried these I don't eat them regularly yeah in fact very infrequently so this will be interesting yeah so so you do get some variants with small batch hot sauces so uh, we have down here oh I should get on mic we have down here a bowl and we have some wing stomp unsauced uh, uh, wings that we are going to that was noisy toss in here here we go. All right. I'm going to put this hashtag stay spicy on the back. I'm going to put this. I don't want it to get messed put it on up the table anything. up there. Up there. I'll stick it or not, there. Whatever. All right. And the gloves are going on for this one because this is not my first rodeo with hot sauces. And I 
know that suffering does not just stop at the mouth and bowels. It goes all the you way. You had to mention bowels, didn't you? I did. It, hey, hot sauce is a is a full digestive experience. Yeah, it was funny. Um, we got some of the Carolina Reaper pepper when all I was right. gardening more avidly. And I've never been one for hot stuff. Let's stick that off the tablecloth just so we don't. Fine. I don't want to stain it up. We got other shows yeah, to fine. do. But anyway, so I've never been a big hot sauce uh, enthusiast. But if I grew it, I was going to try it. So I have tried all of the hot peppers that I've grown and have we've grown. developed a. We've grown. It was a team effort. Sometimes. Um,. But anyway, so I've developed a little bit more of a taste than I used to have, but this is still going to be pretty interesting. How much do you want? Uh, hit it. Hit it good. Hit it. Ah, uh, there we go. One more? Yeah. What? We're, we're spicing up wings. you got to really get it in there. Come on. Ooh. There you go. Now you're starting to... There. Okay, that's probably about right. <laughs> about right's ass. Oh, man. That smells hot. It does. Take a whiff out of the bottle. Don't touch it. it but it's got like a, a, a chili, and I don't mean it by chili really like good, the actually. pepper smell, like like chili, like with meat and this. It's got Ooh. a good. Hit it a little bit more. I'm gonna. I want to make sure we don't we don't forget these edge wings. I don't want anyone. Oh, <gasps> well there you go. Okay, let's do this. You did that. Uh, I want. Hold on. I want people to see here just how much we used out of that bottle. It's down to almost right about the top of the label there. That's a fucking mess. All right. All right. I've got hot sauce all over these things. Well, you're going to have more. I mean, we're eating wings. Yeah, I know. You changing out? Yeah. All right. We got a couple extra pairs, so Whew. this is going to be good. All right. Those are sauced up. Now I'm going to actually set these to the it's side awesome. here. Because uh, the first thing we're going to do is not eat a wing. Right. Um, we have a shout out for every one of these wings. And to start, we're going to take it by the spoon. Oh, here. For somebody that I have been a fan of for a very long time, and who John has been a fan of since she appeared on Hot Ones. Yeah, she, she, she really... Uh, uh, Took hot ones to a new level, and if, if you don't know who I'm talking about, this is Rachel Ray. Um, <coughs> you need to go check out Rachel Ray on Hot Ones. She's super cool. She did the entire gauntlet of sauces. No did wings. Not, did not touch a wing. Did it all oh, out of the spoon. So, this first one, very timidly, <laughs> with much respect, goes out to Rachel Ray. You want me to whack it? No, I want you to leave it alone. <laughs> I'll whack yours. How about that? No. No. All right. That's a lot. Oh, yeah. You're just going to let it be silent, John? Uh, well, um... I'm not she's... nearly as much of a badass as uh, Rachel Ray, so that's all oh, I'm taking. Oh, come on now. Oh, come on. Really? It, this is how hey, we're going to start? It's, it's your show. Is it my show? I mean, it's it's our show, but I mean, this is this is your experience. How's that? I doubled it. Okay. All right, that's what I'm taking. All right. You want to lit it up before we before we do this? Yeah. I don't want to risk getting any extra. All right. All right. You ready to step into this? Yep. Mm. Oh, that is a good flavor. That is a really good flavor. Mm. I'm just kind of like letting it sit on my tongue because I don't want to swallow it. And it's chunky. It. You can really, mm -hmm. you can really, mm -hmm. oh, and the pepper hits you afterward. Oh, that's not nearly as bad as I thought it would be. Yeah. It's good. It's good. Mm -hmm. Now, Rachel Ray never got to experience that because at the time she got on. That's whoa. just a seed. That's it. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's all. It's, They're it's like a, two just whole seeds. It's a whole pepper experience. It is. Oh. Okay, that's good. It is. It's not nearly as hot as I thought it would be. Yeah, I was I was much more scared of this. Okay. Okay, we Don't can let do us this. down, guys. If if I can handle this, we y'all have a problem. We can do this. All right. Now All right, I'm it's thinking we didn't up a little bit. I don't think we didn't put enough. You want to hit it a little more? 
Hit it. I don't know. It's starting to heat up, and I'm a little worried. It is. Do it. There you go. There you go. Oop, there it goes. It started. Oh, yeah. Now, this this one, I'm not going to call it a creeper, because creeper implies that it's not there. This one is a is a ramper. It starts. It's there. But it We're hangs below with the top you. of that label now. All right, here we go. All that right. is not that bad. No, it really isn't. You know, I almost wonder if 357 isn't isn't worse. Yeah. Although my eyes, oh, it's it's causing eyes eye watering. Yeah. 357 usually doesn't do that to me. So it's it's got some different. Um, well, I can see. You want the tiny one? The sauce on there. Oh yeah. What you you want you want to give me the tiny one that's like more concentrated? Is that what you're doing? I'll, to me? I'll give you a big no, it's one. It's fine. It's fine. It's got more surface area. True. <clears throat> Okay. Oh, sorry, guys. Oh, yeah, I'm going to touch the microphone now with my, oh, yeah. my saucy hands. All right, Pinky. Pinky? I, I got to unlock this. All right, who's this one for? I'm getting there. Oh, you can tell we're organized. Yeah. Next up, and I think this is appropriate, Sean Evans. Right, host of the show, right? Host of the show. Okay. Um... I don't know names, yeah. except for Rachel Ray. <laughs> Sean Evans, host of the show, um, uh, producer, or is he? He's delaying so that he can build up my nerves. That's what's happening. No, no, no. But no, but, yeah. but what I love about Sean is he has such a presence on camera. Every mm, time, if you watch, if you watch, and, and this is something I'm lacking as I'm trying to describe <laughs> him. Uh, if, if you watch the video that just came out, introducing the lineup of 2018 sauces, he's just bam in your face, one, two, three, going the whole time. Yeah. Are you ready? Yep. Mm. Okay. Oh, it's got a flavor. That is really fucking mm -hmm. good. Oh, yeah. Like, wow. Mm -hmm. I just got some on my face. My face is going to be burning in a minute. Mm. Oh, the whole thing? Mm. 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 That's good. I'm it's just eating good. it because it's delicious. It is good. Mm. <coughs> there it is. Yeah. <sighs> Oh, fuck. I can feel it in my nose now. Oh, yeah. I want to talk just a little bit. Okay. About Wingate. Oh, yes. Okay. So, Wingate has come in a few different forms. Um, uh, people complaining about the, the temperature of the wings, that the that the, the sauces aren't real, they're not hot. I can tell you, this is a hot sauce. Now, it, it, wasn't, it wasn't the thing I imagined it to be. But I have a lot of heat experience. Mm -hmm. I've been pepper sprayed and 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 done hot challenges so I, I have a little bit of experience with this stuff so whew. yeah i'm feeling it um, you're sweating yeah I I, I'm, I'm going to sweat there, there's former wings here but i, I want to talk specifically about people complaining on on social media that the wings aren't hot that they're, they're doing their fans a disservice i'm gonna say as a as a scoville aficionado that's a rookie move yeah you don't want to eat something that is really hot because the, uh, you mean the hot temperature, right? Hot temperature. Yeah. Because the capsaicin activates the same nerves as heat, as like actual heat does. Yeah. That's what makes it feel like it's burning. So if you got something that is already hot and you put hot sauce on it, you are fucking yourself. it enhances that. So for anyone out there complaining, I guess they're saying the sauce wasn't hot enough for them. I guess. Because uh, that, that that doesn't make sense to me as someone who's who's climbed the mountain before. All right. You want one? Yeah, probably okay. could use it. Yeah, just set that down. Oh, boy. And my face is burning. I'm dabbing this one. Are you serious? Uh, you ain't got to. I was going to do the last one. Uh, I'll do that one, too. It is called the last dab. All right, there we go. I got a dab. All right. <laughs> Let's take some of yours. Okay. This next one. Brett Baker. Okay. Brett Baker, here we go. Oh my gosh, so good. It is. It has an amazing mm -hmm. flavor. Mm. And I think that's the thing that if my mother watches this video, she's going to be pissed at me because I'm not supposed to talk with my mouth full. Mm -hmm. But 
if I swallow, it's worse. But um, mm. the thing that I think a lot of people miss out on with really hot sauce is you don't get to experience that flavor. And yes, it's hot. And yes, you feel like you're going to die. But some of these have such a unique flavor, something that you're not going to get with anything else. And you are legit missing out on it. Absolutely. I want to talk for just a little bit <clears throat> about Brett Baker and who he is, because especially people who aren't fans of Hot Ones aren't going to know him. And even some people who casually watch Hot Ones may not know who this is. Brett Baker has been the super fan of, of Hot Ones since the beginning, as far as I know. He puts out all the lists of, 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 the, uh, of, of the top Hot Ones celebrities <laughs> and, and, and the, the wusses out there who, who don't make it. He keeps up with everything, and he was the only person, I think the right choice, qualified to interview Sean Evans when yeah. Sean Evans sat on the other side of that table and did the interview. So yeah. I, I got to give big props to Brett Baker out there. Whoop, whoop. All right. You seriously on all of them? I'm doing it. Okay. You ain't got to. All right. This is good stuff. I'm counting like no less than 10 seeds already on here. I'm going to say that's what's the hottest. Well, there's, there's at least 10 seeds in that dab. Yay. All right. This next wing, are you just going to bite into it? We're not going to dedicate to anything? No, yeah, sure, let's go. Okay, this one goes out to Chris and Steve, the camera people on set, and everyone behind the scenes on this show yeah. who makes it possible. Yeah. I know there are a bunch of people hiding in the background editing videos who are making this show they're happen. they're hiding. Oh, they're hiding. They're like cowering in the corner. Yeah, they don't want no, the sauce. No, they're working is what they're doing. They don't want the sauce. Yeah. But who make this show possible every, oh, time after time. And uh, I want to give a big shout out to them uh, because they don't get any, the recognition they deserve. So whew, let's do this. It's like fire on my lips. Mm -hmm. And then like a sweet momentarily, mm -hmm. momentarily, momentary fuck release. Oh, yeah. What a relief. I can't talk now. When you like first bite. It really gives you appreciation for Sean and all the celebrities who do it, who uh -huh. who do an interview and keep talking. Oh. And I'm sweating here, and I really don't feel good about wiping my brow. Mm -mm. I'm just going to take the sweat. Oh, my God. Mm -hmm. All right. You ready? Mm -hmm. Oh, my no. lips. It's, it's moving out of my mouth. Yeah. I want to talk a little bit about capsaicin for anybody who doesn't know. All right. Um... John, correct me if I'm wrong on any of this. Switch me out of the gloves. You've studied a lot more than I have. Um, and some. Here you go. And some um, paper towels. Oh, okay. yeah. So anyway, um, capsaicin <clears throat> is additive. If you eat enough jalapenos, you can equal the heat of the ghost pepper, the Carolina Reaper, Pepper X, um, so just because something isn't made with the hottest pepper in the world does not mean that it's not actually hotter. Um, John did a challenge once that I think was ghost peppers. Yeah. I don't know. It was yeah. some, some, one of the really hot peppers. It was super hot. Yeah. Yeah. Super hot. Um, but it was like a concentrate of bunches and bunches of those peppers and yeah. made it way hotter than you would have ever expected oh yeah well and one of the things so it is additive and, and the way it works is it binds to your nerves that that recognize heat and just <clears throat> makes them fire off um so it's pure pain very little risk very little injury but just pure pain yeah it's tricking your body into thinking that you are literally burning On fire yeah um and the reason it's additive is because while a jalapeno may only have so many of those molecules and they bind your receptors. A second jalapeno will bind to that many more receptors. Yeah. And it's just a matter of how many can you fit in a small space or how much can you eat that has that. Yeah. Um, yeah. And, and when I did that challenge, that, that one was a beast. And the thing it that was. made it hard, they advertised it as a spicy burger. Yeah. This thing was this tall. So you couldn't even just fit in your mouth. But because it was so pureed with pepper, 
It was like liquid. The, the, there was not a patty. Yeah, it, it was, was like more a, like a sloppy Joe. Chili. Yeah. Yeah, it was like a sloppy Joe of heat. So you had to trudge your way through it. You couldn't yeah. even, because one of the strategies. You couldn't was, get the relief of the bread or anything else in there. Yeah, one of the strategies on eating hot stuff is to hit it really quick, because then it's already a dedicated. Yeah. And you don't have to keep committing yourself, but you had to like trudge through that one. I actually, yeah. I was ashamed. I didn't finish that one. Yeah. It was one of the few I. I felt bad. I pushed you into that one. Oh, well. I'm pushing into this, so it's, it's payback, right? Is that what this is? Maybe. You're like, Whoa. oh, fuck. Here, you want some? Here, I'll just take this. I'll take this. Really? Yeah, let's really? do it. Really? Oh, it's on my gloves now. You're like literally dripping sweat. Yeah. Whoops. <coughs> <coughs> um. I just lost audio in one of my ears. That, oh, no, my ear's ringing. That's not... I Your thought, ear's ringing? Yeah, I thought the audio went down on, on the left side, but no, my ear just started ringing. Oh, okay, let's right. do it. Who's this for? Oh, yes. Number this four. one's important. I can't believe I almost forgot. This one goes out to all the Six Pack Philosophy fans who have supported us and got us here. Uh, all the way through three seasons of just podcasts. Now into YouTube. Oh my god, I'm having trouble talking. Yeah. Um, now into YouTube. Uh, our patrons on Patreon who keep us going, who keep us with this equipment, and who we keep coming back for. You guys are the reason this show is still around. We love you. Absolutely. And we're about to eat some really... This oh my for you. God, this is so much sauce. Let's okay. do it. I totally just like... Dabbed yeah. off some of You're this. cheating the cheat? I give you a mulligan and you're cheating the cheat? Well, I realize it's for the six-pack fans, so oh I'll, I'll take it. The Let's whole do thing. It. Mm. Ah! Oh, God. Mm. Mm. Heat has a flavor. This has such good flavor anyway, but it's almost like copper pennies. Like when you <laughs> buy... No, I'm telling you, capsaicin has a flavor of its own, and it's like a metallic flavor, and I'm building up so much, I'm starting to taste the heat before it burns me. Only one more left, and I, and I think this is appropriate. Yeah. All right. We got to dab this one. We've got to. Oh, my God. Oh, this is getting real. You know, and, and that's... Go ahead. That's part of the, the respect you got to have for the people in the show. I know you just saw us hit one, two, three, four, five on a spoon, which I'm going to say you need to respect that. And if you don't, go do it yourself. But the people in the show, they've been primed. They had so much pepper before then. And now this is an added on top. So when you hit this fifth wing, you're really kind of more in the experience that they're at. Yeah. Oh, my God. Ready for the last dedication? Yeah. Who is it? DJ Khaled. Oh, right. DJ Khaled, who quit three wings in. Now, our original plan we were going to shoot this was we were going to dedicate DJ Khaled and put it on the plate and not eat it. But you know what? We're not you know, going to stoop to his no, level. We're going to eat the ones he couldn't. Absolutely. Well, not all of them. So I think we there need were to, so many left. I think we need to, to end this with a with a quote. Or well, not end the show, but the last <laughs> wing. It needs yeah. a quote. DJ Khaled. If you stop, it doesn't mean I gave up. I think it meant you gave up. Mm. Mm. Oh my god. <laughs> mm. Somebody needs to say DJ Khaled's name on top of this mountain because he ain't never going to make it. <laughs> oh my god. <sighs> Alright, okay? we did it. Yeah. We did it. We got through all five wings. We got through the, the spoon of Rachel Ray. We've unboxed the sauce. We've tried it. It's delicious. Thank you so much, Sean Evans, for bringing so much joy to our lives and watching this. And now I have a little bit more appreciation for what they're doing. Oh, my God. Does any last words from you? I, I can't. Don't my teeth hurt. <laughs> <You're> <laughs> oh, my. I'm like, burning, ow. like, right here. Oh yeah. My. Like, and I say my teeth, like, my gums just hurt. Like everywhere that there are nerves hurts. Oh yeah. Oh my face, my oh my hands luckily not so much. I've had I've I've had where my hands burn. Is it time These to close gloves this one out? Fucking saved it. Oh yeah. Alright guys, thank you so much for tuning in. Thank you for all the six pack philosophy fans who have stuck with us all this time. Thank you to any hot ones fans who have mess. who have come and, and checked out what we're doing here. Uh we if you could please uh, take a moment, 
Check out some of our other videos. Like them if you do. Subscribe so you can check out what we're doing every single Wednesday on YouTube. Mondays on the podcast feed. And um, stay with us. We're going to stay with you. Uh, this has been a, a awe-inspiring experience. And we are glad you chose to share it with us. Thank you so much. I gotta say... I have a little bit less respect for the people. Like I have a lot less respect for the people who punk out. Tell. Oh yeah. yeah, if you punked out, get out of here. You you uh, don't deserve to be sitting in that chair. I know that uh that Sean Evans has come out many times and said I still give him the plug because what I'm going to do and I respect that. But I don't know why you get to sit in that chair. Oh my yeah. god. All yeah. right. All right. It's been fun, guys. But uh, I need some milk. All right. Cheers. That's how we close out. Cheers with this. Yeah. Sure. Okay. Cheers. cheers. Fuck. Okay. Oh, man. You want this? Yeah. Let me go stop the video.